What's up, everybody? Welcome back to an all new episode of Conflicts. Like today, we'll be looking at Galio. That is right, this year is a USB adapter. I know we haven't really reviewed one before yet, but this one here is quite unique as it features 120 watts power to charge your devices, meaning you can charge among a variety of devices all at once at full speed. I mean, your iPad, your MacBook, your robot, anything you want all at the same time. Now it includes two USB-C's and a USB-A charger port, so you do get a good amount of flexibility. Now, this particular product is on Kickstarter, so if you guys wanted your very own, check out the link down below in the description. I think it's priced about $59 right now, which is actually a pretty good darn deal for what it is. Now, let's go ahead and take a closer look at this thing. So this here is the box. Of course, it is a prototype, but it is a prototype of the final product, meaning it's fully functional and voila so you can see that it does look quite cool it comes both in black and white we have ourselves a nice black version and then over here it says 120 watts you get your three different ports including the two usb c's and your usb a and then on this side here you have a foldable prong so this particular prong can go ahead and charge into the american outlook and these go ahead and fold it back up and you can go ahead and carry it about now size wise it's incredibly small so you can actually see compared to my business card it's actually about the same size. However, this side here is quite thicker. Now, other than that, I think it's actually a pretty cool look, uh, very sleek and weighs about a pound, I would say. It's not, not too heavy. So essentially, it cuts the charging time of most devices by half. So for instance, uh, the Apple's new iPad Pro uh, is cut by half compared to the original 18 watt power adapter. And the fact that it actually has its own like safety cutoff means that it can essentially charge it very safely. So you have a variety of different ports. So you got the two USB-C's uh, and then you, of course you got the USB-A right over here. Compatible with a, a wide range of devices including PD 3.0, QC 4.0, QC 3.0, QC 2.0, PPS, SCP, FCP, AFC, and PE Plus and almost all fast charging protocols in the market. So it won't overshoot it, it won't discharge it, it won't do anything of that nature. So you got iPhone, Samsung, Pixel, you name it, it's all in there. Now, and the one that it does mention is the Nintendo Switch. Now that is the most trickiest thing to charge that I've noticed. Uh, and it's kind of unique that you can actually charge that and charge your phone, charge your laptop all at the same time. Now, it's got foldable USB pins, uh, I'm sorry, US pins, I apologize, US pins. You can see that it kind of falls down just like that and you see put them back up just like that as well. Now, uh, it's very portable and it doesn't weigh too much. Uh, it's actually quite light. Uh, I would say probably like a pound. Um, and then it kind of gives you a nice little breakdown in terms of everything that it compares it with. So comparing it to like the Hyperjuice, Apple, Rad Power, and the Anchor Atom PD4, it actually outbeats them all. So definitely cool, definitely very unique. Comes both in black and white. Uh, and yeah, you can actually go ahead and purchase one right now for about $59 on Kickstarter. So definitely a useful tool, uh, especially if you're traveling about uh, and you have to charge multiple things like my camera or other devices such as robots. Now, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you had any questions about it, feel free to comment down below. Otherwise, thank you again for watching and I'll see you guys next time. Take care now. Bye-bye.